Hey guys, it's Maximilian Billion here, and today I'm going to be making a discussion video. Yeah, I don't usually make a lot of these, but today I feel like making one because I want to know something that, I, that I've been wondering for a while. Will there be a Just Cause 5? Now, I know what you're thinking, Just Cause 4 only came out two or three years ago, but I still want to know because so, uh, usually the answer to any of these types of questions, like will there be a blank or when will blank happen, it's always usually a possibly, but I want to know if it's leaning more towards yes or more towards no. And we're going to discuss a couple of things like when it might possibly come out and what it might be about and like who the antagonist might be. Um, so let's just get straight into it. So for the people who don't know what Just Cause is, Just Cause is an action-adventure video game series created by Avalanche Studios. The series consists of Just Cause, Just Cause 2, Just Cause 3, and Just Cause 4. The games are open-world and primarily take place in islands. Each game in the series tasks a player by giving them tools, such as the parachute, grappling hook, and wingsuit, to overthrow a governing body in the game setting. By June 2018, the series had shipped over 15 million copies worldwide. The series directly draws its name from the real-life United States invasion of Panama, codenamed Operation Just Cause. So, you get the point. Basically, Rico has to, like, overthrow corrupt government, and each game, the I think it's different. So, we're gonna, like, discuss who the antagonist might be by looking at the previous antagonists from the game. So here are the previous antagonists in the Just Cause game. The antagonist for Just Cause 1 is Salvador Mendoza. The antagonist for Just Cause 2 is Pandak Panay. The antagonist for Just Cause 3 is Sebastiano Di Rivallo or, or General Di Rivallo. And the antagonist for Just Cause 4 is Oscar Espinosa. Now, I don't know who the antagonist could be in Just Cause 5 based off of these names. And in each game, they, they're all, like, corrupt. So what I'm assuming is that if they would make Just Cause 5, they would come up with someone new and just make them corrupt just like all the other ones. And so now we're going to move on to what like what the game would be like like not the antagonist but how would you play in it and stuff like that so for on to what just cause 5 would be like if they made it i think the ending to just cause 4 kind of explains it a lot so for the people who haven't finished cause 4 yet spoiler alert because i'm about to play the ending and also credits to the channel who i got the ending from so yeah here's the ending the agency you conspired with to murder my father. Such a shame. Your father's brilliant work was the foundation on which Project Diapo was built. And as for you, your army's steady advance gave my scientists just the kick in the pants they needed. Rico Rodriguez. Always doing the agency's bidding, whether he knows it or not. So, should I expect a check? Listen, I have a hard stop in a minute, so I'm going to need to put a bow on this. I will find you. No. No, you won't. Everything and everyone on that mountain is about to be decimated by the wrath of a thunder god. Once you're all dead, I'll deliver the storm core to the agency and settle accounts. They are incredibly excited to finally receive delivery of their new toy. Your toy is going nowhere, Espinosa. Hmm. The core finished charging a minute or two before you cut the power. It's launching as we speak. Say hello to your father for me, Rico. He's going to kill everyone on this mountain.
bugging you to the flight controller, Mira. Hurry! We're locked out. We can't stop the storm. What is your plan, Rodriguez? Gabriela? I'm open to suggestions. Stand by. We're in. I disabled the firewall. I'm not sacrificing the lives of my soldiers for that man's pride. But can you stop this storm? Only Espinosa can stop it. Give Rodriguez the flight controls, and he can steer the storm for us to see. I have a better idea. I told you I'd find you, Oscar. Rodriguez? That nicety is commendable. Did my father ever tell you the Rodriguez family motto? It's not something we ever really discussed. Don't fuck with a scorpion, unless you're prepared to get stung. Wait. Wait, 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 we can make a deal! Oh. <laughs> I mean, you can see why I thought it was aliens. It was a flying saucer, see or not. If I told you about the things we didn't finish... Wait, what? Ay, dígame, dígame. Izzy, get over here. You have to try this. Hey, I'm a vegetarian. But it's real American barbecue. Oh, no, no, son. This isn't real American barbecue. This, this is grilling. No, the only real barbecue comes from Central Texas. <laughs> Just like me. Don't fuck with the scorpion. Something Espinosa said. My father and I have always been pawns in a larger game. Whether we knew it or not. You think that's true? He was. Maybe not in Solis. Well, definitely not in Solis. Destroying Project Yapa must have cost the agency trillions. It always comes back to the agency. That it does. Let's take them down. <laughs> Let's take down the agency. Son of a bitch. All right. I'm in. I'm with you too, Rico. We're with you. We have an army. It's not a bad start. Come on. We'll tell the others in the morning. <laughs> So as you saw there in the ending, Rico was talking about how it came back to the agency and how he wanted to take down the agency. So maybe they can do that in Just Cause 5. If they ever make Just Cause 5, they can have, like, Sheldon and Rico and Mira take down the agency. And now I don't know which agency they're talking about because I haven't really played much of Just Cause 4, so... Yeah. Now the next thing that I want to talk about is when it might be released. Now... 
Just Cause was made in 2006, Just Cause 2 was made in 2010, Just Cause 3 was made in 2015, and Just Cause 4 was made in 2018. So, it seems that all of them, like, have a four or five or three year difference in between all of them. And since Just Cause 4 was made in 2018, I'd say, like, maybe either this year, 2022, or 2023 is when the next game might possibly come out. Just just by looking back at, how, at like, the year between them. So, that might, that might be when, the, when it come out, but... Uh, then again, they might not even make it just cause five. Just cause four might be their final game. Like games do that sometimes. They they'll make they'll make a certain amount of games, and then they'll just stop. That's what happened with the Batman Arkham series. They made four games, and then that was just it for them. They just didn't want to make any more. So that could be it with this. So the conclusion I think is obviously possibly, but leaning more towards yes and also leaning more towards no so like leaning more towards the no but a little bit more leaning more towards yes because after all the like the evidence like the ending and when each game come out and the antagonists i think that i think they they will make a just cause five i don't know if it's anytime soon but i know that they 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 might make a just cause five so that's my conclusion so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to hit the like button. Comment down your opinions of what you think of this whole Just Cause 5 thing. And um, make sure to join my Discord server. The link will be in the description. And credits to the person who I got the the ending from Just Cause 4 to. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.